I'm sorry for them that their city was destroyed. I would say I feel bad for you, and I wish that tornado didn't hit, and I wish that everything was okay. They may be small, but their hearts are so big. Meet Mrs. Bajeris' third grade class at Central Grade School in Traverse City. 30 students who want to show compassion and support for the Oklahoma tornado victims. They need help um, to build new houses, and they need money to do that. Our classroom really felt strongly about doing something and uh, taking it to the next level. What can we do school-wide, not only with our classroom of 30, but what can we do in a building of 700? So bright and early, these youngsters got to work on coordinating and kicking off a school-wide penny drive. We're working on making posters for the Oklahoma um, tornado. I had a partner, and we drew this jar with money in it, and we drew money signs around it. Please help us. Our plan is to put up some posters around Central Grade School, and we have some jars in the office that students can bring in any spare change they have. Um, every penny helps. It's amazing what these eight- and nine-year-olds are doing and ready to give and help people that they've never met. is amazing. The love and support for the tornado victims in Oklahoma doesn't stop here at Central Grade School. In fact, about 15 miles up the road, students at another northern Michigan elementary school are showing they care. You can see genuine concern on the part of these students for other families and, and people in Oklahoma that are, that are going through this. Westwoods Elementary just wrapped up its annual Penny Wars drive, where students raised $800 to benefit the Red Cross's Heroes Campaign. Every year we participate in the Red Cross's uh, Heroes Campaign, so we're asking our local chapter of the American Red Cross to direct our Penny Wars money uh, towards uh, the folks in Oklahoma. In Traverse City, Kate Fox, 7 and 4 News.